Well, the rain is partially out of our region and out of our area right now, infiltrating some portions to our north, but it's coming back into the forecast as we look at our weather headlines. A weak overnight front tonight, but mostly clear going into the evening hours. Rain chances Wednesday to Thursday and triple digits. Yes, you see it in the bottom of my forecast. Some hot weather coming to the Concho Valley. Winds are out of the west at 9 miles per hour. Temperature at 93 degrees. Pressure at 10.03. Villabar visibility at 10 miles with some nice cumulus covers bubbling up there across the area. Thanks to a warm front that's bringing some atmospheric moisture and some moisture throughout the plains. Now, Iowa into Missouri and then portions of Kansas and Nebraska. Even getting a little snow mix there. They're cooler there as well. Temperatures in the 40s. That warm front helped bring us some severe weather last night. Now that's moving somewhat out of our region and cloud cover lingering into eastern Dallas area and into Dallas into Waco area as well. We will be holding on to clear conditions. Now, that low pressure system that I showed you, there it is right there. It's going to swing through the Midwest. That's where it's next destination. But this one coming out of the Rockies is going to bring active weather to us Wednesday to Thursday, picking up wind speeds coming into the forecast as well, but also giving us a chance for some rain. But the hot weather does come as well. Sprinkles and showers possibly Wednesday morning, but the active weather comes here Wednesday afternoon. Showers and storms high to be in the 80s this day. Then as we go into the afternoon, clearing out, and then another round Thursday before the heat picks up, triple digits looking in the forecast Saturday into Sunday. Definitely want to make sure you stay hydrated this weekend. A great weekend to go to the pools. Thursday, some of us could pick up in our southern counties, isolated shower or two, but definitely Wednesday looking like the best overall day for scattered showers and storms. Maybe lingering into Thursday as well, wrapping up by Thursday evening. Then sun comes back, and man, we're going to be hot. Look at these numbers, triple digits across the Contra Valley Saturday and Sunday that the heat continues. And remember, if you're going to be outside this weekend, drink plenty of water, remember your pets, and also remember to take care of your plants as well because we're going to be hot. They're going to need some water as well. Temperatures going up and also rain chances going up for the next couple of days as well. 20% for Tuesday. Wednesday looking like the best day. Thursday holding on to a 40%. And then lingering into around 10% early Friday before the heat kicks in for us tonight. We'll get down into the 60s. Some of us in the northern counties, they get a little more of that cool atmosphere behind that front. Maybe in the 50s again, but I'm thinking warmer as we go into the southern half. And then the next five days, well, they look something like this for us across the area. Rain chances going up, scattered storms, more isolated Thursday, Friday, 10% there. Triple digits in the forecast this weekend. Plenty of sun, sun, sun. Hit the pools. Remember, it's a great day to get some ice cream, some snow cones, whatever you need to stay cool. Just remember your pool safety tips. And also, remember, if you're going out to the pool, to apply the sunscreen because the heat index will be up going into the weekend. We'll be back with more Case Land News.